I am Dr. Radhika Sheth, Consultant Fertility and IVF Specialist, practicing in Cloud9 Hospitals, Malad and Vashi. I have been practicing fertility and gynecology since the past 12 years. Infertility is the inability of a couple to conceive within one year of marriage. De depending upon the cause or nature of infertility, the treatment varies. Typically, out of 100 cases of infertility, 30 would be due to the female partner, 30 would be due to the male partner, 30 would be a combination of both female and male partner, and 10% are cases where we do not know the cause which comes under the umbrella of unexplained infertility. In my cases, we may just give few tablets to the uh, wife so that she produces her eggs. When these eggs rupture, which is monitored by follicular scan or ultrasound, we then tell the couple when to have intercourse depending upon the time when the egg is released. This is called ovulation induction with timed intercourse or planned relation. If few cycles of this do not work, we can progress to the next level of treatment which is IUI or intrauterine insemination. In intrauterine insemination, we start treatment usually on the second or third day of the lady's period where we give her hormones in the form of tablets and sometimes even injectables with the aim of producing one, two or a maximum of three follicles. When these follicles rupture, which usually happens around 13th or 14th day of her period, we tell her husband to give us his sperm. We clean the sperm by a process of centrifugation where we remove the dead forms, we remove the immotile forms and we transfer the good motile concentrate into a uterus using a painless technique called IUI or intrauterine insemination. IUI has a success rate of around 12 to 15 percent per cycle. If multiple IUI cycles haven't worked, say six IUI cycles or depending upon the case, we sometimes even shorten the trying time to three to four IUI cycles. If multiple IUI cycles don't work to the tune of say four to six IUI cycles depending upon the case, we may need to advise the next level of fertility treatment which is in vitro fertilization or IVF.